also been an interesting year for you. Um, winning the Netbank Cup, breaking into the Pirates team, also being part of the under-23s as well. You still have to fight for your place back and, and, and go to the Olympics next year. How would you look back in 2019? Uh, I think I I think the first thing is I don't I don't believe in in in, in looking back and you know um, patting yourself in the shoulder and say I've done this I've done that I think for me it's just a step um, to 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 greater things because I have I have, I have bigger ambitions I have bigger I have bigger goals and dreams so but I am really really grateful for for, for what has happened um, I think it came to 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 a lot of people's surprise but not myself because I think uh, I think. Looking at how hard I work, um, how how much work I've put in before, I think I do deserve at least a part of it, you know. <laughs> but yeah, I think I think it's really really been a good year, and um, I hope that um, only greater things can happen. You know, obviously now I just need to be patient and wait for my turn. But you can ask anyone who's at the team, you know, any, anyone who's around me. They know I'm still working hard. I'm still very disciplined because it's not the first time that I uh, that I, I sit on the bench for this long. And you know, when I do play. Um, I, I always do well. I think the only time I don't do well is when I don't play. So I just need to wait for my time. And yeah. So in this first half of the season, you didn't get enough time. I'm sure you're not really um, looking to go out on a loan again. You want to fight for your place. No, no, no. Um, I think, uh, like I said, people who, who have been around me, uh, they, they, they know my history. You know, even from under 19, or under Pirates, I come in, I don't play. Uh, I start playing, I score goals. You know, you go to the SAB, you know, the first half of the season, I played a few games. Second half, I play. We even, uh, then we go to Project X and come back. I go on loan. I don't play first half of the season. I come in and I play. Obviously, I hope, I, I actually hope that it's a, it's a trend that I will, I will eventually stop. But I, I always know that yeah, because every time I don't play, I work even harder. Um, I believe in myself even more. And I know that I have a point to prove. And now it's worse because obviously now a lot of people know me and a lot of people look up to me. A lot of people... Um, want to see how I handle the situation and so far I've, I've handled it very professionally and yeah I'm, I'm hoping to stay I'm very happy at the team it's a, it's a big team we work hard um, I think we have so much support everyone is happy so yeah and especially when also there's a new coach who comes in he's always looking forward to giving everyone an opportunity and it's an opportunity that, that you want to, to miss yeah I, I think um, I, I think this is the first time that it happened to me where coaches, uh, uh, the team changes the coach. But I think I, I, I sat down uh, by myself and I thought about it. And, and you know, I think every situation that you, you approach in life, it's, 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 it will always um, come out how you look at it and how you, 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 you react to it. I think uh, so. Yes, this is an opportunity for everyone, not just me, everyone at the club. Um, I think obviously it's the. I think how do I, how do I put this? Everyone starts on a clean slate, you know. Uh, whether you are playing or not, you maybe you impress this coach, but you might not be able to impress this coach. Maybe you didn't impress this coach. Now you can impress this one. So it's really, really an opportunity. Um, the coach has spoken to everyone and then made sure that they understand that everyone starts on a, on a, on a clean slate. And I, I think, if um, God willingly, I will get my opportunity, and I, I need to grab it because I know how big it is um, to play for Orlando Pirates. I know how big it is um, to 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 be there, you know, to be part of the team, with the dream come true. And yeah, I hope that when I do get my chance, I'll be ready and then yeah, everything will happen. How's been this first three weeks uh, to four weeks working under him? I think it's really been good. Um, even the mood um, around the training, you know, um, no one is sulking, no one is, is th uh, thinking about other things. Everyone is happy, everyone is hard, it's hard working. I think it's been the same as it was before. Uh, obviously now there's just a slight change of, of energy and the atmosphere, but, but it's really, really been good. But with, with this arrival, do um, you think the energy that he's bringing, um, it's something that will bring a different party in the second round? Hopefully. I think, um, it's, uh, uh, I think he's there for a reason, so I, I, I just hope that we, us as players, we help him you know, achieve his goals and yeah, when we help um, carry the team forward. You are around a very strong attack and experienced internationals as well. Do you see that rubbing off? Um, rubbing off me? Yes. Yeah, yeah, I think so. I think I've, I learn a lot every day. You know, as, as much as I don't play, you have no idea how much of, 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 a, of a good relationship we have as forwards there. It's, it's, it's amazing even when you see we sit together, we laugh together. We always challenge each other at training, you know. Uh, 
So yeah, I, I think it's it's rubbing off me because if you check the the, the, uh, the type of players we have, we all, everyone is different. You know, one has his, his own traits, one has his own traits. So it's just you having to learn and having to 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 try and put that all together and try and become a very good player. I think you'll agree with me that um, amongst the attackers that we've got, and already you're an in international as well, uh, we don't have a lot of number nines like yourselves and Mabasas um, and others, even even at the under 23 level. And, I, and I'm sure this is something that you like to turn into your advantage. Yeah, of course. Uh, I would like to think so, that, um, that I, I'm a natural number nine and uh, I always try and learn every day. I always, always ask the coach, what do you want me to improve, how? And then, and, and what should I do? So, yeah, I, I, like I said, I have, I have bigger ambitions. So I, I hope that I do, you know, um, God willingly become that number nine that we that we lack, you know, as a, as a as a as a football um, facility in this country. Through the inactivity, not getting a lot of game time, you also missed out on going to the Afcon Under 23 as well. I'm sure your heart was so there, knowing what you 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 were doing. Previously, uh, with that under 23 team, I'm sure going into this Olympic year, you'll want to see both of it happening, getting regular action, so that you can be part of the setup going into Tokyo. I think I haven't, I haven't, I, haven't, I was very happy that we qualified, but I haven't thought about Tokyo because I'm not playing. So I don't think it's possible if you're not playing. So I think for me, the first focus is trying to, to fight for, for the 18, and then, yeah, we take it from there. But obviously, I do want to go. I don't think there's any under 23 player who wouldn't want to go. And that is a special team from, from, from how you see the team playing the typical South African brand of football, but also getting the results as well. The, 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 the under-23, it's a very special team. You have no idea. The, the talent there is just immense. I think, but I think as a country, we've always had that. Uh, we all, it, there was a time where there was um, the, um, an, an era of, of um, Tugutugu Makanya or Kifli Remi, you know, Lebohamu Kwena. You know, I remember that time, you know, so I think it's just, uh, we, we should just pray as a country that we, we get the right support, we get the right guidance, and yeah, and then that, uh, that whoever is involved in the team, whether it's, it's the management or the technical team, they do choose um, the right people, and I think it, it's all about coaching, you know, sometimes we always focus at, 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 at results and, and, and all that, but I think, yeah, we just need, um, I, I think the people who are there, they Yes, they are, they are good people. So I, I just hope that they, they continue with, uh, with having good hearts and, and having to, to dedicate their time and, 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 and their effort you know, into, into trying and bring out the best uh, Bafana Bafana of tomorrow.